Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. According to Microsoft, Windows 11 was their smoothest rollout ever internally as a company when it comes to upgrading operating systems. And this was in a post on their website, I'm unpacking Microsoft's speedy upgrade to Windows 11, posted on the 5th of April this year. Now they say here that in five weeks, Microsoft rolled out Windows 11 to 190,000 devices across the company. And this is thanks to improvements to a tool set available to all organizations, which according to this post is the Microsoft Digital Employee Experience. And they say here that um, their priority in rolling out Windows 11 internally was to provide employees uninterrupted access to a safe and productive workspace while giving them a chance to try out the new operating system. And this upgrade to Windows 11 at Microsoft, they say, was divided into three parts. The first was their planning, where they identified an execution and communication plan, then developed a timeline. Then they prepared, they established reporting systems, ran tests, readied employees, and built back-end services. And then the actual deployment and rollout of Windows 11 internally deploy Windows 11 to eligible devices. Now these three main parts, planning, preparing, and deploying, can be divided into some subcategories. And I will just mention those for you um, uh, quickly in this video in case you are interested. Now, um, according to Microsoft, their Windows 11 rollout was the smoothest ever uh, because first of all, they um, found the devices and analyzed the devices that would meet Windows 11's system requirements. And then they uh, used the Microsoft Digital Employee Experience, as I mentioned earlier, to skip devices that should not or could not get and receive the Windows 11 update and upgrade. And then they also divided the uh, deployment of Windows 11 into different waves to roll out the new version of Windows gradually. And then they had a rollback plan. And then they also asked employees to complete all their pre-work needed for a successful upgrade. And then they had support teams, um, Reddit support, which had time to use Windows 11 and learn about the uh, operating system before uh, the actual deployment internally as a company. And then they also had you asked users who had a business reason to opt out of the upgrade process just to make things uh, smoother. And then um, they had a security model where uh, they were building off several specific Windows 11 security policies uh, in test environments where they say was used to benchmark against Windows 10 policies. And then the actual deployment, they say they used Windows Update for Business Deployment Service to automate the uh, deployment. So according to uh, Microsoft, that's the reason why um, Windows 11's rollout internally as a company was their smoothest ever. And I will leave a link down below to this post if you are interested, as it's quite in-depth and quite a bit of information, if that is something you would be interested in. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.